Now, let's stop talking about soccer. Let's get into some football talk, specifically about what happened down I-35 today. That's right, Texas State had their spring game for the second for the second time under G.J. Kinney's tenure. And this is my first time seeing Rennie Sunbelt Player of the Year and James Madison transfer Jordan McLeod. Things didn't start off great for the new QB1 as Bobcat defense was on the prowl for picks. They wrapped up three interceptions before the offense sniffed the end zone. An effort Coach Kinney was proud of. I know I'm an offensive coach, but I tell these guys I'm a defensive head coach now. Uh, the way, the way, I've told them about two weeks ago. I told them, I'm a defensive head coach now. So yeah, Coach, at one point, Coach Kenny was joking around and saying they're going to call him a defensive coach. So uh, he's definitely been around more. Coach Kenny's got experience on both sides of the ball, though. We got a real defense. I think that D line and secondary and, and we're linebacker, everybody. I mean, we got we got a chance to be special, but, you know, it's just spring. I mean, that's always the goal is to get turnovers on the defensive side, you know, and just impact the game. So um, to be honest, that's been a big emphasis this spring is just getting to the ball and, you know, and that's what we did. Eventually, we started to see McLeod cook, though. He would find all reliable Joey Hobart over the middle, who then takes matters into his own hands. Now, that was cool, but I was more impressed with the touchdown celebration. Look at this. I need that move for the next wedding I go to. Now, on the final drive, McLeod issued a 10-cent IOU after dropping this dime to the back corner for a touchdown. After those interceptions, it was clear the new QB1 had control of the offense and was happy to show out in front of his new fan base. Obviously, it's a game, but you know, throughout spring, uh, that's this is the time to learn to get better with your teammates. Um, getting time down, like I said, I got here like I think I had two weeks of workouts, and then we went right into spring ball. Yeah, I think that was good to face some adversity. You know how it is, like you got all this player of the year and transfer and in this. I'm sure you know it was good to to have this game day type atmosphere, get out there and and, and feel those butterflies and, and come out there and perform. And I see why he's player of the year. <laughs> he makes really good sound throws. He's got a nice touch on him that I haven't seen in a little bit. Everything's earned. Nothing should be given. Um, even the job. You know, I got to come out and operate and compete every single day. In case you're counting, we're 140 days before Texas State's season opener. A lot of unfamiliar expectations for this squad, but they seem poised to achieve 